Hi friends. Today we will study about stone as a building material. It forms one of the most important building materials in landscape and architecture. They are derived from rocks, which form the earth's crust and have no definite shape or chemical combination, but are mixtures of different minerals. Depends upon geological classification of rocks, stones are classified into following three categories. Igneous rocks. Sedimentary rocks. Metamorphic rocks. Igneous rocks are primary rocks which are formed from the solidification of molten magma. They are further classified as Entrusive igneous rocks and Extrusive igneous rocks. Entrusive igneous rocks crystallize below Earth's surface, and the slow cooling that occurs there allows large crystals to form. Some of the examples include Diabase, Diorite, Gabbro, Granite, Pegmatite, Peridotite. Density of these varies from 2500 to 3500 kg per cubic meter. Extrusive igneous rocks erupt onto the surface, where they cool quickly to form small crystals. Some of the examples include Pumice, Obsidian, Scoria, Basalt, and Esite. Tough. Density of the rock varies from 700 to 3100 kg per cubic meter. Sedimentary rocks are formed by the weathering of pre-existing rocks and the subsequent transportation and deposition of the weathering products. There are three basic types of sedimentary rocks. Clastic sedimentary rock. Chemical sedimentary rock. Organic sedimentary rock. Clastic sedimentary rocks are formed from the accumulation and lithification of mechanical weathering debris. Examples include shale, sandstone, brescia, conglomerate, siltstone. Density of these rocks varies from 1500 to 3200 kg per cubic meter. Chemical sedimentary rocks are formed when dissolved materials precipitate from solution. Examples include limestone, dolomite, flint, iron ore, Rock salt. Shirt. Density of these rocks varies from 1500 to 5900 kg per cubic meter. Organic sedimentary rocks are formed from the accumulation of plant or animal debris. Examples include chalk, coal, diatomite. Density of these rocks varies from 860 to 2800 kg per cubic meter. Metamorphic rocks are formed by extreme heat, pressure and chemical processes on the parent rock, igneous or sedimentary, usually while buried deep below Earth's surface. These extreme conditions alter the mineralogy, texture, and chemical composition of the parent rocks. Metamorphic rocks are further divided into foliated metamorphic rocks and non foliated metamorphic rocks. Foliated metamorphic rocks have a layered or banded appearance that is produced by exposure to heat and directed pressure. Examples include gneiss, phyllite, schist, slate. Density of these rocks varies from 2500 to 3300 kg per cubic meter. Non-foliated metamorphic rocks do not have a layered or banded appearance. Examples include marble, quartzite, novaculite, hornfuls, scun. Density of these rocks varies from 2200 to 3300 kg per cubic meter. Now let us see the uses of stone in construction and landscape. Stones are used in landscaping for garden sittings, walls and paths. It is also used for the construction of infrastructure projects like dams, 
bridges, aggregate in reinforced concrete, road and railway line base. Stones are also used in construction of houses, wells, compound walls. Stones like marble and granite are also used for aesthetic purpose. This video was conceptualized by architect Moen Aziz Merchant Mehmuda and edited by Mrs. Elena Moen Merchant. Please like, share, comment, subscribe, and hit the bell button.